Hello guys, my name is Matthew and in today's video I'm going to show you how you can integrate Zendesk with Salesforce. First things first, we want to create ourselves an account at Zendesk or log into our existing account. In this video I'm going to show you how we can make th uh, this integration work through third-party app. So in our case I chose to use automate.io which is very easy to use app for integrations and so on. And I will leave the link in the descriptions underneath this video. Once we are at automate.io, we want to go to the top corner of our screen and click on integrations. Straight away, we want to go to the bottom left part of our pop-up window and click on see all categories. We want to start with app integrations and we want to start with the first uh, app that we want to integrate. In our case, it's Zendesk. Once we integrated Zendesk, we want to go and proceed with its counterpart, which will be Salesforce. Once we write down uh, Salesforce, straight away we are redirected for integration window and we can pick from some already integra uh, integrated parts like popular integrations, for example. If we pick the one that suits us, we, want, we just hit try it now. And we are a few clicks away from finishing the integration. But if you won't be able to find the one that we are looking for, keep scrolling down so you can create your own integration. Just remember, on the left side underneath the triggers, we want to scroll down and we want to start with the Zendesk. There are still tons of options, but I'm going with the first one just to show you how it's done. On the opposite side, underneath the actions, we want to go with Salesforce. I'm sticking to first one as well. All we need to do is click the Try It Now button. Yet again, we get redirected and all we need to do is register or log into our account at Automate. We can also use Zapier.com, as you can see, uh, which is a very similar app to Automate. And once we are here, we want to go to the top left corner and click on Create Zap. Once we click on Create Zap, uh, we get redirected and we want to start with writing down the first app we want to integrate, which is Zendesk. Trigger event, we have to pick manually. Let's go with the first one. Now we have to log in to our Zendesk account through Zapier. Now we can test the trigger between Zendesk and Zapier itself. On the second action, we want to start by picking the, uh, the app uh, for action again, which is Salesforce. Action event, we have fewer to pick from. I'm going with the first one, we click continue. And the next thing is just to log into your uh, Salesforce account. And that's about it. So thanks for watching and see you on the next video.